Good morning, everyone. Um, as I was introduced, uh, my name is Anthony Armstrong Emery, and I'm seeing myself there. The wonders of Photoshop. Um, what I'd like to do before I start is I'm not someone who likes to use a lot of slides, so I think I'm here more to sort of introduce EcoHouse Group. Um, it's with a great honor and great pleasure that I was invited by Straits Times to sponsor this event today. I hope you're all enjoying it so far. Um, a little bit about why I'm here. The whole idea of today is to present investment strategies for 2013, the year of the snake. I'd like to think that as an investment option or an investment strategy, and being the world such a huge and wonderful place, with so many different markets and different opportunities that present themselves to us, that Brazil could possibly be an option for any one of you here. The reason I say this, Brazil is one of the fastest growing economies in the world. There are huge amounts of things happening in Brazil. There is a lot of focus from the world in general on Brazil and what is happening in Brazil today. And the reason for this is, one of the main things, or one of the most interesting little facts, is Brazil is going to hold the World Cup for football in 2014. And then also in 2016, consecutively, the Olympics. Now we all know what these kind of sporting events do in countries. We've seen what happened in China. We've seen the infrastructure that went into China. We've seen all of the improvements. We've seen South Africa also go through those changes. But not any one of these countries has had both events, one after the other. So what is that actually doing for Brazil? It's actually creating a surge of investment from abroad taking advantage of the opportunities that are now being presented. Whether it be companies that are going into Brazil for infrastructure works, whether it be companies investing in Brazil to service all of that infrastructure that's been put in place, but they are investing, and in a very big way. So if the world is investing, if these huge multinational organizations are also investing in Brazil, why not any one of us? And this is the reason why EcoHouse was formed in 2009 to address one of the little opportunities that Brazil has to offer, which is the social housing program that the Brazilian government has launched in 2009 to attend to a huge increase in the Brazilian middle class demographic. The Brazilian middle class has grown by 34 million people in the last decade and is expected to be, by 2014, over 120 million. So for a country of 200 million population, and whatever country you look at in the world, when the middle class demographic does this, the country also does this. Now the social housing program is to make sure that there is enough housing for all of these new middle class to actually live. So for the first time in Brazil's history, mortgages are now readily available. Credit cards, which is something we take for granted, also now readily available. And Brazil is going through this change. And we all know what HDB is here in Singapore, yes? Now, HDB, if you look at HDB, go down to the HDB office now. Is it full? Yes, it's full. Why? As with any social housing program, there is always this demand. Okay? And now we're getting it at the very, very beginning. The Brazilian social housing program is very, very new. And this is where EcoHouse comes into play. And this is why I took the opportunity today to sponsor this event here. Okay? So a little bit about me. I've been in this business for 20 years. I am the CEO and founder of EcoHouse Group of Companies Worldwide. We have over a thousand staff in over eight different countries. A lot of that staff will be in, is in Brazil. We are the largest civil engineering and construction company in the north, northeast of Brazil with over 17 years of experience developing and building properties throughout the country and we are one of the largest social housing developers in Brazil. I also own a couple of football clubs for anyone who likes football. Okay? Again, World Cup 2014. Um, to explain Brazil to actually show you a little bit about what's happening in sort of a visual medium, I've prepared a little infographic video. And I hope that the infographic video that you're going to see now will explain a little bit better than me as to what is going on and the opportunity that presents itself. So, please, could you... 
Okay, guys, I hope everyone enjoyed that, and I think that explains a little bit about who we are. What I'd like to also continue and say is this. According to Property Guru, which I'm sure all of you are very familiar with, EcoHouse last year launched in Singapore, and we were the most successful investment product to launch in Singapore in 2012. We raised over 60 million Singapore dollars in four events. Okay? Now, some people say, well, why do more? Why carry on? Purely because 40,000 homes is why. We have to develop 40,000 homes. That's my target. That's my mad target in my mind. Okay, so for that, the product has been created. For that, the product has been extremely widely accepted. Property Guru has also spoken about this. Straits Times invited me to obviously talk about this as well. And so what I will do for you guys is say, look, we're here. We have a stand outside. I'm not going to keep on talking about Brazil and keep on taking up your time. I would like to invite you all to speak to any one of my members of staff outside. If you're interested in finding out a little bit more of what we do and what kind of returns we offer and what sort of products we offer. Okay? Or alternatively, I think in your little goodie bags that you have there as well, there is an invitation to our Suntech head office here, whereby we invite everyone to come on a series of days over the next couple of days to find out more, speak to people one-to-one, -one, and see exactly how you can get involved in, like I said before, one of the fastest growing economies in the world. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen.